everyone! Welcome to Linda's Thrifty Life. I am so glad to see all of you. If you're new here, welcome. I hope you find something on my channel you enjoy. And if you are a returning friend, thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy day to watch me. Oh gosh, where are we today? It is Thursday. Tomorrow is Valentine's Day. I'm trying to keep my XO and my hearts on my head. Oh, I don't have that big a head. I know it probably looks like it, but headbands just try to slide right off of me. So, I wanted to say this is my cat theme today. We're here to serve. Yes, I am in caretaker mode 100% right now. Um, <clears throat> Mom is still not feeling very good. I mean, it just really took a lot out of her. And she was already not well and... She is not very happy about it and thinks she's going to bounce right back and get her um, energy back. And I'm praying she will, but I have a feeling that she's going to have a new normal. And as you age, that's what happens. You keep reaching these levels, you know, as you go kind of downhill. And that's your new normal. You know, you used to be able to cook dinner and now you just can't. You used to be able to, you know, wash clothes and now you just can't. So, it's extremely hard for her. She's just a very um, much a person that thinks that, you know, she should be doing something all the time and, and keeping busy. And so this has been hard for her. So, I am in caretaker mode. And as I told my daughter yesterday, I said, but this is not sustainable for very long. I can only do this for so long. 100%, you know, caretaking. And um, so I, I'm... I'm going to call and check and see how far on the list, if the list has changed at all for, for her um, independent living situation. I would still rather she go to assisted living, but she is still resistant, so we'll see how she is in a month or so. Um, we do go to the doctor tomorrow for a follow-up, and so it'll be interesting to see what he says about everything. So, meanwhile, yesterday I had some more errands to do. I needed to get some water, um, bottled water for my mom, and just a few other little things. And of course, I stopped by the Dollar Tree because I was meaning to get um, some more of these little containers to put in these containers because it'll hold 12 of them and you can put all sorts of little doodads in them and, and keep them all separated. And I had completely forgotten on Tuesday. So I was able to find two packages of these. And they are small, but you can get 12 of them in one of those cases. So I thought that was pretty good. I also found... Um, let's see what's new. What's new? What did I find new? I found... I know I shouldn't have got this, but it's so cute. And it's... it's um. It's like Play-Doh with an Anna, Anna not Anna, Anna stamp, Stamper. And Scout has just been all about Anna lately. So um, I figured for that, if nothing else, I'm starting to leave stuff here. And then she finds it when she comes to visit me. Um, let's see. I got one more pack of Fingerlings Minis. And I, I'd open these. I'm kind of curious what these are. And... Um, so we'll see if I decide to do that at the end of this video. While I was in there, I picked up another bag of these butterfly bag things. Another three pack because they are so pretty and I want to do some stuff with them. Uh, one of my viewers, or friends, viewers, left a message that these were not new. That they had seen them in DT before. So that's very encouraging that, that they have them, you know, every year so. Um, they're just, they're gorgeous. They're gorgeous. And uh, there might be a little giveaway coming up. You never know. It's so I bought, um, so much of this diamond wrap was already gone, but I bought an extra one of these. And I might come up with a little giveaway or Mother's Day or something. And in that theme with the colors, I found these um, butterfly die cuts. Their colors are beautiful, and I did buy two of them, one for me and one um, probably for a giveaway. 
they're just, those colors are so pretty. So I picked up a few things for an upcoming giveaway. And speaking of upcoming giveaway, I'm still working on adding things to the cat and the dog box. And I found these. And these are so cute. They're little puppy dog socks. And they've got little ears on them. I just think they're adorable. So these will be going, and they're pink and stars and a cute face. And so they'll be going in the little doggy box. I have lots of cat socks, as you can well imagine. And I also got these, and I don't know if I'll wear these or give these away to someone, but these are little koalas, I think. But the ears, the ears are so cute. So, I just had to get those. I know. I didn't really, but I did. I didn't, but I did. I didn't, but I did. I found this um, Bible Notes by Crown Jewels. And it's an E, and it says Choose Joy, and this is going to be for a friend of mine whose name starts with E, and I think she knows who she is. But, you know, since joy and choose joy is one of my favorite phrases, I just saw that with the E and said I've got to send that to her. So that'll be going in a goodie box to her one of these days. <laughs> I'm so bad about one of these days. So all of this was from the Big Dollar Tree. So I was walking by, and they had that in cap thing. Okay, everything is trying to come right off of my head. Hold on. I think we have to abandon the, the hearts and just go with the XO. Yeah, that's better. So I think um, a lot of you, and I see once in a while, some of you say that you get stuff out of the markdown bin where thing, a package has been opened and something's lost or broken, and they sell it for half price. I very seldom see anything in there that I'm interested in, but this time I saw these and there were two of them for 50 cents and the original package was three for a dollar, so I was excited about that. I got that and I had gone looking for some more adhesive labels <clears throat> and I could not find them at all and this one, the package had been opened but it looks like everything is in there, but it was open, and so it was 50 cents. And I could not find those labels anywhere else, so I was really thrilled to get that. And then I picked up these two bubble mailers, and there's two in the package, and this one has been sliced, um, like when they were opening the case or something. But I can slap a piece of tape on that, and I can use that mailer. So, 25 cents each for the mailer, so 50 cents for two. Yes, ma'am, thank you. And then I went to the small Dollar Tree. I, I just had to go over to Walmart, so I thought I would... There's one that's right close to it. And I'm so glad I did, because I found this super bright desk lamp. Now, I've seen a lot of you carry this in... Uh, haul this carry you carried it to the to your house and you hauled it and so I'm real anxious to see if it might give me a little more light you know in here sometimes it just gets so dark in here but it's a cute little thing look at that cute I could do a spotlight and it runs on batteries so I will I will make that work and we will see what we think and then this just jumped in my cart and I think it's for me look at that it's Mickey Mouse, and it's pink with the little pink polka dots. It's so cute. And I imagine that I'll put it out in the in the toy area, and Scout will really like it. But it's so cute. I just, I had to get it. So then I went to Walmart. And the big reason I went is because I saw Creative Chica Halls share these Glam Lipstick Pin Valentines. And they're... They look like lipsticks, but they're an ink pen. And I thought, oh my gosh, Scout would love one of these. And they would be cute to do in friend mail and different things. And when you do little glam letters or glam, glam bags or whatever, one of these would be fun. So these were not on sale. They were $2.98 for six. But I just thought they were so, so cute. And so I bought just one package. I do not plan to buy a lot of um, Valentine stuff on clearance because I just have so much, but I may pick up a few of those because they're just so cute. And 
I if I find something on 90 90% off I might buy, but otherwise I have told myself I am not buying a bunch of uh, Valentine clearance. So let's see how I do. <laughs> so in the Walmart, I also saw this, and I know it's it's um, it's made for St. Patrick's Day, but look at this. One lucky grandma. I had to get it. I will wear it not just... I will wear it not just for St. Patrick's Day, but all the time because it's just cute as it can be. And I don't have a whole lot of t-shirts that say anything about being a grandma. So I think that was $5.98. And I just, I was in a mood to uh, treat myself. So now wait till you see this. Precious, precious, precious. This is not for me. This is for Scout. But it is so cute, and it was $2 marked down, and I couldn't find the original price, but I think it was closer to 6 I cannot read these tags sometimes, but um, I think it's adorable, and she'll love it. It's got the little ears and the little pink roses, and then the gold. She'll love it. So I picked that up for her, and I picked up... Is that it? Yeah. And I picked up one more thing for myself. I <laughs> I need a smaller wallet. I have a clutch that I love, but I don't carry it just separately. I put it into my, um, I put it in my purse and it's so heavy. And I just, sometimes it takes up so much room. And so this is just cute for, and smaller. And it was originally $7.97, and they had it marked down to $2. So I was like, yay! So this will come off, and I'll just I can put a cute little pom-pom on it or something. And and I just loved it. I just They had several. They had glitzy ones. They had the, the, um, the sequin ones that changed colors. But this was the only one like this, and I was like, oh, yeah, that one's mine. <laughs> so... So that is my Walmart and my Dollar Tree haul. And the only other thing I have, and let's see what we're, we're at 12 minutes, so let's whip this out real quick, was I got my Ipsy bag, and it's so pretty. Look at the color for February. It's this soft rose, and it's a real soft bag. So pretty. And I got a free product this, this month. I don't know why, but... I never wanted to turn down a free product. And I got this um, Sila Creme de la Creme. So that was my free product that they included. So I'll check that out. Then I got this Girl Powder. And it's Cheeks on the Go. The packaging is adorable. And the color is very pretty. So there's that. Um... And it's called, the color is called Houston, which is really funny because, of course, that's where a lot of my family lives. Then I got this pressed highlighter called Fairy Dust. It's really pretty. Look at that. I mean, the packaging. I haven't opened it up, so how would I know? But it's got to be pretty if it's Fairy Dust. Let's see what it looks like. woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Oh. Kavos. I don't know who this is. I do not know all these makeup-y things because I'm just, you know, not that. <gasps> oh, that is pretty. Can you see it? Let me put some on my hand. Ooh, it just gives a really pretty shimmer. Oh, I'm gonna... Oh, I would like that. That's very pretty. And then I've got a primer. Um... Uh, which would be good like on your eyes, I think. A little primer. And then a water uh, all-in-one collagen ceramide cream. And the lip this month was a matte lip paint. Look at that. Let's see what color it is. I can never tell from the packaging 
Well, I have a combo lip on today of flamingo and um, and wine, wine as wine, wine, wine as in W I N E wine. Yeah, I like that combination. Ooh, let's see. Woo! But it's a matte color. Ooh, that's interesting. I might have to try that on my lips, but I bet it's drying. I usually find um, mattes to be kind of a drying thing, so let me find a Kleenex and get that off my hand. So that's it, my friends, and I hope you're all ready for um, Valentine's Day tomorrow. Um, I wanted to thank everybody that participated in the Valentine mini letter mini pocket letter exchange. I think everyone got their pocket letters and I thank all of you so much for joining in and, and uh, we'll have to do that again sometime but not anytime real soon. <laughs> but I love doing it. I appreciate all of your participation and the beautiful mini pocket letters you sent each other and it was fun and I'm going to go back through and see if I can um, make a list of all the ones that were able to to make videos about them and, and uh, maybe I'll publish that list one day. So thank you all so much. Love you. Wish you a happy Valentine's Day tomorrow. I will be taking mom to the doctor and then we might take a um, special dinner together afternoon, early afternoon before the crowds start. So I will talk to you in the next few days. Love you guys. Thank you so much. Bye now.